Hey guys, this is Davis again from Davis Comic Finds, and I'm coming at you today with a different kind of video, I guess. Uh, I'm not showing any comics. I'm going over my top 15 for 2019. There's top 15 that I would like to get uh, in 2019. Um, some of the numbers have multiple issues, uh, just because they're not so not going to be so hard to get. Uh, the higher price books will be one. There'll be one book on as an, as a number, but uh, I guess we'll try to start from the bottom and work our way up. Let's see. Number fifteen, mysteries of unexplored worlds, number forty-six. I'd like to have a fine copy or better. Uh, this is a book, one of my first Silver Age books that I had when I was a kid. Uh, my copy's pretty rough. But uh, I'd like to track down a nicer copy of it. Uh, I found a copy last year, but it wasn't as nice as I thought it was when I purchased it. So hopefully I can track one of those down. Shouldn't be a very costly book. Uh, number 14, All-Star Western. This is the second series. Issue 4, 7, 8, and 9. I have all the other issues, just looking to complete that run. Uh, 13, Brave and the Bold, 57, First Metamorpho. Uh, that's just one a book that I'd like to, I'd like to, or I would like to have. Um, I've wanted it for a while, and I've been looking for one at a good price, so I'd like to track one of those down. Number twelve is a combo, uh, Ultimate Spider-Man, Volume Three. I guess it's called Ultimate Comics Spider-Man. Uh, this is the Miles Morales. Uh, this one's I think all Miles Morales. Uh, but those are the issues that I'm missing. You can read them right there. I'd like to track those down. Number 11, Incredible Hulk issue 109. Um, just a really cool cover. I've always liked that cover. Big Cat cover. Shout out to Mr. Rigamorse86. Uh, just really like to have that cover. Number 10, The Demon 3, 11, 12, 13, 15, 16. Just the issues from that series that I'm missing. I'd like to track those down. Uh, number 9, Daredevil 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. That would give me all but issue 1 of the first 25 issues of Daredevil. Um, so, looking forward to, or looking to track those down. Love to track down a copy of issue 1, but that one might be a ways down the road. Uh, issue, or not, number 8, TMNT Adventures Special Issue 3, 5, 6, 10, and 11. Uh, just the issues that I'm missing from that set. Uh, number 7, X Men Issue 32. That's the first, uh, I think that's the first Spidey crossover with the X Men. I'd like to track one of those down. Six Batman 189. Now we're getting into the little bit pricier books. Uh, first Silver Age Prince Scarecrow Batman 189. Just one of those books I'd like to have. I used to see them for like 40 50 bucks, and now they're more like over more like a hundred or more. So hopefully, I can track down one at a good price. Number five TMNT issue number three, first print. Uh, one and two. We're probably outside of my price range right now uh, in first print, but I don't like to track down issue three. I've got a lot from this series. I've got over half the series, but I don't have a lot of the earlier ones. Uh, number four, Batman 237, first appearance of the Reaper. Also a Neil Adams cover, also a very cool cover. So i uh, like to track that down. Number three, Batman 235. Not 235, 232. Uh, first, Ra's al Ghul, another Neil Adams cover, another big book that he did. Uh, I'd like to trick, check, track one of those down. Uh, yeah, uh, number two, Golden Age issue of Action Comics, one of the ones with a large banner. I know, I think at least the first 75 have the large banner. I don't know when they actually stopped with the large banner. Uh, it's probably in the 80s or 90s. Uh, as far as the issue number. Um, so I'd like to track one of those down. It'd probably be towards the latter part of that series. And last, 
but not least, Amazing Spider-Man issue mm -hmm. one. This is the first time I've had this on the list. Uh, trying to sell some books that I've got doubles of. Uh, and some of the books that I really don't want to raise enough money to get a copy of this. I don't want to spend over 5000 I'd like a 2.0 or 2.5. I don't know how realistic that is. Prices have been going up on it, so um, we just have to wait and see what happens. Hopefully I can track one down, though, at a good price, uh, and hopefully I can get the money saved to do so when I see it. So that's my top 15 comics for 2019. I've actually tracked down a few of these already, which I will show in the video. Uh, I'll probably shoot it in a little bit, uh, but I wanted to get this video up there first so you guys could see what I'm I'm going to be looking for. And uh, let me know if there's anything that anything on the list that you're also looking to get this year, or uh, let me know what you think about the list. Uh, hoping hoping I can get that number one uh, this year. It probably won't be in the first part of the year, but maybe towards the end of the year, I'll be able to to check that one off. Uh, just have to wait and see. Going to have to spend less on comics, which you'll see in my next video. I've now got off to a good spot, start, but uh, less is more, and I need to need to have get less so I can have bigger books. But uh, but anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Like I said. And as always, have a great rest of the day.